Welcome everyone to our Branksome Hall Carol Service, entirely reimagined in this unique year, but nevertheless with the same intention as ever, to bring us together, to embrace joy, and to celebrate music and the spirit of the season. In this virtual space, we have an opportunity to come together with community members both near and far as never before. We embrace this new environment and we hold steadfast to those traditions that are meaningful and give us comfort in this unusual time. Since the 1960s, the Carol Service has brought the community together to celebrate the holidays. Though we are unable to share seasonal music together in person, we do hope you enjoy these archival photos and audio footage you'll now see, along with the rest of the service that our student performers and music teachers have worked so hard to prepare for us all. I extend my warmest wishes to you and your families for this holiday season, and I look forward to a time when we can be together in person once again. Good evening. My name is Leighton Simons and I am this year's Head Prefect. On behalf of the Branksome community, I welcome you all to our annual carol service. I hope we will look back on today's service, despite the challenges of being apart, and remember how our music teachers and performers all made certain we could come together as a community to create some much needed positive energy and seasonal spirit. As we honour our community's cherished traditions tonight, 
I'm optimistic this event will be held in a more traditional way next year. We truly hope this program is enjoyable for you. Your presence here today, sharing our performances, means a great deal to all of the students who are participating. And we also thank our music teachers for imparting a love of music. Music definitely has the power to uplift and bring us all together, even if we're not all physically together this year. On that note, I hope you're all in a cozy, nice place at home on this Sunday evening. So please, sit back and enjoy the wonderful music. Hello everyone, and thank you so much for joining us for our 2020 carol service. It has been a unique year full of learning, creativity, and innovation in music, and we are so pleased that we can celebrate the holiday season by presenting some of our students' work in this way. My name is Scott Harbin, and I am the music coordinator in the middle and senior schools. I teach band classes and direct our co-curricular bands. Hi, my name is Alexandra Bourque, and I am teaching strings, vocal, band, and diploma music from grades 7 to 12, and direct our co-curricular orchestras. Hi, everyone. My name is Agnes Ng. I am the vocal music and instrumental music teacher uh, in the middle and senior schools. I also work with the chamber choir as well. And I'm Luanne Schluter, the music teacher in the junior schools. 
one of the first things that we discovered in March is that it is impossible to play music or sing simultaneously with someone else online. The lag through the internet simply doesn't allow it. The performances that you're seeing and hearing today were recorded in a very unique way. Each student had to record their part individually at home while listening to a backing track through headphones to ensure that they stayed together with everyone else. To create the full ensemble, audio and video engineers edited everyone's individual recordings together. We are so proud of all the students from the junior, middle, and senior schools who took on this challenge. It was a learning experience for everyone, including ourselves, and so different from the ensemble experiences we are used to. We're grateful for the enthusiastic participation of so many students and want to congratulate everyone on your fine performances. We'd also like to take a moment to thank the team of people who made this event possible and allowed our musical visions to come to life. Judith Friend, the instructional leader for performing arts, Kim Graham, Sky Constable, Chris Caraggio, and Andrea Astor from the ACE team, Sandra Bolte, Carrie Weinstock, Kim Nyaz, and Dr. Mira Gambier for their consultation and support, Camille Lively, Christian Amundsen, and the team at Arts Laureate for putting together each of the musical numbers, and Christian Peterson and his team for doing the rest of the audio and video components. We hope you enjoy the rest of the program. And on behalf of the music faculty, we wish everyone a wonderful holiday season. Happy holidays. Happy, Happy holidays.
The holidays mean to me a time to be grateful, appreciate everything that I have, and spend quality time with family and friends. Christmas time means a lot of joy to me. I get to see my family, I get to eat a lot of good food like chicken and turkey, and I get to see a lot of my family members that I don't get to see often because I live in residence. Uh, for me, it means to like spend time with my family, and I don't get to see them very often because I live in boarding. So it's nice to come back home and just spend time with my family and siblings. And we usually do like a big dinner with all of my like cousins and my grandparents. So it's always nice to see them again after such a long time of like not seeing each other. And we usually do like gifts after dinner and we like stay up like a good amount. <laughs> like we go to sleep at like 2 a.m. Just like talking and laughing. And yeah, it's very like family based. <laughs> Hi. Um, so spending time with our family. And we're and when I was playing with Matthew. Over the holidays I like to go skiing and watch Christmas movies. We're so excited for spinning dreidels because it's really fun. And we're excited to light candles. During the holidays, I like relaxing because it's the holidays and you have to relax. And I also go to like snowboard and ski trips and snowboard in the hills. What I'm looking for is I'm going to my grandma's house and I'm excited to see my family.
Just mom is I know, I'm Yeah. Hi everybody, it's Mr. Harvin. I'm here with my parents, Mr. Harvin and Mrs. Harvin, and my favorite sister, Diane. One of our favorite uh, traditions in the holiday season is on Christmas Eve, when we gather with our extended family, have a very relaxing day, and enjoy a dinner that's a mixture of everybody's favorite dishes. Um, and at the end of the dinner, we have our family's famous ice cream snowball competition. Everybody gets their own plate with a ball of ice cream, some frozen whipped cream on top, and some shredded coconut. Except mom doesn't like coconut. This is true, no coconut on mom's. Uh, and everybody has a birthday candle in their snowball. The idea behind the competition is that uh, you gotta keep eating your ice cream ball with your candle still lit, and the person who can keep their flame lit the longest wins. But of course there are no prizes, and usually we can't remember who won uh, one year to the next. Well, I won last year. I don't think so, wasn't it Julia? I'm pretty sure I won for the first time ever, because I never win anything. Maybe, maybe. Well, happy holidays, everybody. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Every year, my dad, brother, and I go to pick out a Christmas tree. And when we get back, we have this little family meeting to decide on a theme. And we will decorate our tree accordingly. So the theme is basically what the past year means to us, or um, kind of just the Christmas vibes or holiday vibes that we want in our home. And so we've done music and winter wonderland, and I think this year we're going to do family just because uh, this year especially we've realized the significance of family and community and stuff like that. And yeah, so we're, we're excited. How does my family holiday? We enjoy inviting family and friends over on Christmas Eve for a hot pot. It's a fun way of cooking dinner, having lots of laughs, and making the night last all night long. Although this year is going to be a little bit different, I hope however your family holidays, it's a fun one. Wishing everyone a wonderful holiday and looking forward to seeing you in the new year. Cheers. Happy December from Miss McAnally at the Uniform Shop. Just wanted to let you know about one of our holiday traditions. Uh, we make some holiday cookies and hot cocoa and have a movie marathon. Some of our favorites include It's a Wonderful Life, Scrooged, The Grinch, Home Alone, uh, Die Hard. Anyways, I just wanted to wish you and your families all the best, and we'll see you in the new year.
Hello, I'm Jenny. Um, we don't have any special traditions in my house because we don't even normally celebrate holidays and all kinds of festivals. But um, we will gather around once a year when December ends and New Year begin. And I think the whole point of these kinds of holidays and festivals is to have a reason to cancel everything and just fly back to your family and spend time with the people you love and have fun. So remember to have fun, everyone. Happy holiday. Our tradition for our family is a merging of cultures. On December 26th, Boxing Day for uh, my family, my husband's family was Jewish. Uh, we have the, the whole families come together, usually, not this year, um, but we do latkes. So uh, a fried potato pancake of sorts with applesauce, sour cream, and, and all the fixings. And, and we merge our cultures together with a big celebration and usually a puzzle. For me, the carol service has always signaled the start of the winter holiday season. Having grown up in the warmth of South Africa, I have come to appreciate the beauty of this time of year in Canada. The short cold days and sparkling lights as heavy snow covers the trees and blankets the ground. Our traditional Branksome carol service is integral to this time of year. If I close my eyes, I can hear the exquisite music and the sweet, uplifting voices of our students. I also see the joy and pride in the faces of our parents and community members. For my family, at this time of year, our tradition is to gather for Hanukkah. Our house is filled with excited children, the warmth of candlelight, and the sizzle of potato latkes in the oven. This year, however, it will be different. There will still be latkes, but I will package and drop them off at each family member's house, and we will wave to each other from the door. What endures at this time of year are our feelings of care for each other and our gratitude for the people in our lives. Tonight is the fourth night of Hanukkah, and later this evening, I will light four candles on the menorah. My very best wishes to you all. Hi, my name is Cameron Burke and I'm a grade six student. To me, the holidays are all about spending time with family. I really enjoy going to my grandfather's house, watching Christmas movies, making snowmen outside, and especially the big dinner at the end. We usually do a big sleepover at the end too. Unfortunately, things will look very different this year due to COVID-19, but I'm still very grateful that I have a family to spend time with. Happy holidays, everyone.
thank you for inviting us into your home for this special carol service. It might have looked a little different this year from past years, but we've enjoyed reimagining the seasonal celebration and sharing our music, stories, and traditions with you. And thank you to all the performers and organizers. You've done a great job and it was such an incredible event to kick off the holiday season. Every year, as the first snow falls, there's something in the air. It's hard to describe, but it hangs as the soundtrack changes around us, as lights string the trees around our neighborhoods, and connections with our communities are more valued than ever. We start to believe that despite this unique year, the spirit of the holidays is alive and bringing us together, even if it's virtually. Yes, things are different, and we have to be more creative in the ways we celebrate. But together with classmates and teachers and staff, with parents and alums, and of course with you, we will keep finding ways to celebrate. We'll keep seeing the snow fall and feel the sense of community and holiday spirit together. I wish the season's best to you and your family. And as this year's carol service comes to a close, I invite all of you at home to join us in singing our final carol of the evening. Hark the herald angels sing. Happy holidays.